Doc, hey. Michael, I'm looking through my appointment book and I don't see your name. Yeah, well, I'm more of a walk-in guy, Doc. You know that. Walk-ins are more expensive, but I'm always happy to accommodate. Sure, you'll accommodate me as long as I got money in my pocket, right? Hey, I'm in a bad way, Doc. I might come by soon. Well, Michael, I see you're back around and making time for your mental health. Yeah, I don't know why I came. Hmm. What do you want, Michael? I don't know. I just... I just want... I want something that isn't this. You know? This caring about two things at once. I mean, I want to be a good dad. Love my family. You know, live the dream. But at the same time... I really want the other stuff, too. I suppose you haven't really considered the fact that by neglecting your therapy, you've guaranteed these behavioral relapses. No, I hadn't considered that. So, pal, what's the source of conflict this time? Things are kind of on the uptick, Doc. There's no greater concern than optimism. Where are we now? Ah, <laughs> uh, today's getting hard to keep track of who wants to kill me at any given moment. <laughs> Trevor still wants to eat my liver, but we're playing nice because we're working a job together. The FIB, they want me dead uh, because I'm no longer useful to them. The investor guy who hooked me up with the studio, he's pissed off because I didn't burn it down for him. But the wife and kids are back under the roof. So maybe things are OK. Mm-hmm. Well, family is important, Michael. But make sure you want them there for the right reasons. Any other acting out, friend? Tell me. <sighs> I ain't been a good boy, Doc. I mean, you know, things just all of a sudden get up on top of me, right fucking on top. And then I lose my shit. And I hurt people, and then I feel bad about it. I, I'm a fucking prick. Remorse is good, but not as good as taking control before you act out. I want to be good, Doc, I really do. But then I get angry. Hmm. Anything else? Anything sexual? I've been a really good boy, Doc. Really good. Not one problem. I'm glad to hear that. Really glad. Keep working it. This is great. So, I feel like there's progress in some areas and, you know, none in others. That's incredible stuff. I don't think I've ever heard such a barrage of denial, self-justification, and outright horror. The thing is, Michael, here, can we just get a quick photo together? Cheese. What is this? I really think I can't treat you anymore. The fact is, I'm in love with you. The fuck are you talking okay, about, Okay, well, Doc? that's not true. <laughs> Good. You're learning. Good. What's going on? Nothing. It's just, I think you need a new therapist. And I'm leaving town. I've got a TV show. I'm going to be famous. I'm going to be famous. <laughs> think of the fucking tale. All those fucking bitches who called me pube head. Oh, <laughs> they'll be lining up to suck it now. You got a TV show. You! Uh, best not to think too closely about what I just said. It's not like I'll be using real names or anything. <laughs> I'm really discreet. <laughs> Bye now. Fuck. This kind of exposure will push you to the help you need.
I'll shove your show up your ass, Doc.